Secretary. Meanwhile, the Broward Sheriff's Office is investigating a shooting that left two people dead and two others injured in Pompano Beach. NBC6 reporter Julia Bagg live from Broward Health North where those surviving victims were taken. And Julia, we understand you have your you got your hands on some new surveillance video. Yeah, it is quite graphic, although we've blurred some parts of it for you. We do want to caution you about that. Broward deputies this afternoon saying tight-lipped about exactly what happened and the conditions of the two people who survived, who were brought here to Broward Health North last night. But when paramedics arrived yesterday, it was too late for two others. Surveillance video captures the panic and the gun smoke outside a Pompano Beach convenience store last night. People dashed for cover, but for some, it was too late. It's really horrible. The store manager told us he wasn't here when the shooting happened on Northwest 27th Avenue, just north of West Atlantic Boulevard. But it scared his employees who were here. It told, they broke my glass, window, everything. After the smoke cleared, an injured man hobbled into the store. Broward deputies say they found out about the shooting just after 9 o'clock last night when they showed up with paramedics from Pompano Beach Fire Rescue. Two people were dead and two more were injured. They put down more than a dozen yellow evidence markers and examined bullet holes in the store walls as well as cars parked outside. Investigators had a tow truck haul off a red Mercedes sedan that was full of bullet holes. What exactly led up to the shooting remains a mystery. Now, if you know something that could help detectives with this case, you can call Broward Crime Stoppers. That number is 954-493-TIPS. Reporting live in Deerfield Beach, Julia Bag, NBC6 News.